In this video, we shall learn pharmacological measures in the management of pain. The common drug being used is paracetamol. It can be given either oral or per rectal. The dose is same for both the routes, that is 10 to 15 milligram per kilogram per dose. And the frequency is 12 hourly for less than 32 weeks babies. 8 hourly for 32 to 36 weeks gestational babies and we can give 6 hourly 12 or more of 37 weeks gestation. The other common medication which is used is 25% dextrose. It is given at a dose of 1 to 2 ml 2 minutes prior to the procedure. Very commonly used other medication is 24% sucrose. It is given orally at a dose of 0.1 to 1 ml that is 0.2 to 0.5 ml per kilogram 2 minutes prior to the procedure via pallade or using a syringe. We also use local anesthetics like proparacaine. This is a topical drug which is used prior to retinopathy of prematurity screening. It is available as 0.5% eye drops. One drop should be instilled in each eye just before the procedure. Injection morphine and fentanyl are good analgesics. These drugs cause respiratory depression. Hence, should be used very cautiously and only be used in mechanically ventilated babies. Now, let us understand the various drugs used in management of pain in newborns with their respective doses. Injection fentanyl, it's given bolus as 1 to 5 microgram per kilogram intravenously, slowly over 5 to 10 minutes. As an infusion, it can be given 1 to 5 microgram per kilogram per hour intravenously and it is available as 1 ml ampule containing 50 microgram. How to prepare it? It should be diluted either in normal saline or 5% dextrose or it can be diluted even in 10% dextrose. It is incompatible with injection phenytoin and phenobarbitone. So to summarize, these are the various drugs used in management of pain in newborn babies with their respective doses. Through this video, we have learned the non-pharmacological and pharmacological modalities which can be adopted to minimize the pain and avoid stress in infants.